Hello viewers, I welcome you all to your own channel, Korobida is the educator. Those who are new to this channel, please subscribe the channel to get the latest CBSC updates and many other educational interesting videos. So in today's video, you will learn some multiplication tricks. Yes, you are right. So that you can save your time in exam. Generally, you have seen in mathematics paper, every time students say they are not able to complete the paper because of lack of time. So using these tricks, you can save your time in exam and which will definitely help you to score good marks in mathematics. So watch the video till end. So here first trick, how to find square of a number ending in 5. That means any numbers which ends in 5, 25, 35, 75, 85 whatever you take how to get the square of this number easily very very simple 25 square is equal to all of you know first this it is what 5 5 5 is a 25 you write here then after 2 this number is 2 after 2 what comes 3 multiply these two number 2 3 is a 6 you put here so this is the answer. Isn't it interesting? Next, suppose 75. Let us take a bigger number, 75 square. Again, 5 5 is 25. You write here. Then this number is 7. After 7, what comes? 8. Multiply these two numbers. 7 is 56. How fast you can do? You just see. 85 square. 85 square. So 5 square is 25. Now after 8, what comes? 9. 9 8 is just 72. Isn't it interesting? Yes. Maybe you are thinking, can we do for 3 digit number? Yes, we can do. So this one you just see 125 square. So 5 square 25. Then after 12 it comes 13. 12 into 13 you can check it is 156. That one also I will show you. How to calculate easily 12 into 13 any two digit number. Easily how can we find out the answer. So this is the first trick. Isn't it interesting? So trick number 2. How to multiply any two digit number by 11. Any two digit number you take. We are talking about two digit number. Where units place will be there and tens place will be there. Any number. Suppose if we take a number 36 into 11. Very, very simple. Listen. First you write 3. Then in bracket 3 plus 6. Then 6. First this number 3, then this number 6 here, then in bracket 3 plus 6. So answer is 396. Isn't it simple? Then 47 into 11. Little bigger number. Then first 4, then 4 plus 7, then last number is 7. Now... Answer will be, first here it will be 7, 4 plus 7 is 11, as you know. So 1 will put here, then this one we have to add with this 4. So 4 plus 1, the answer is 517. Isn't it interesting? Then next, let us take some other number, 96 into 11. Now first 9, then 9 plus 6. Then last number is 6. Then here it will be 6. 9 plus 6, 15. So here it will be 5. 1 we have to add with 9. 9 plus 1, 10. Answer is 1056. You can check yourself. Any other number will try. 82. 82 into 11. So answer is 8, then 8 plus 2, then 2. So here it will be 2, 8 plus 2, 10, 0, 8 plus 1, 9. Very, very simple. 
Topic number three. How to multiply any two-digit number? Okay, very interesting. Suppose 12 just in the first trick we have done. So that is why I am going to show you this one first. 12 into 13. 3 to the 6. Answer will be 6. Then you cross multiply. 3 ones are 3. 2 ones are 2. So 5 will be in middle. 1 ones are 1. Once again I am repeating. 3 to the 6 in units place. Then you cross multiply. 3 ones are 3 you have written. 2 ones are 2. Add this 2 number. Equal to 5. This will be in middle. Then 1 ones are 1. So answer is 156. Next number. Suppose 34 into 42. 4 to the 8. Units please. Then multiply these two number. 3 to the 6. 4 for the 16. Add these two number. 22. So 2 will be here. And this 2. 4 3 is 12 plus 2. It will be 14. Interesting. Then 64 into 32. 4 to the 8. Then 6 to the 12. 4 3 is 12. Add this two number 24. So this 4 will be here. And this 2 you have to add. Multiply this 2. 6 3 is 18. Plus 2. 20 to 0 4 8. Very very simple. I am going to show you some more. Okay, so next, suppose 22 into 45, 5 to the 10, so first 0, then carry 1, here you write, then cross multiply, 5 to the 10, 2 for the 8, add all these numbers, so it is 19, 9 will be here, and multiply this to 4 to the 8 plus 1, 9. Answer is 990. So trick number 4. How to multiply any number by 25? Yes, you are right. Any number, any number you take. First you take suppose 128 into 25. Okay, at first what we'll do, as you know that there are four 25s in 100. Because 25 into 4 is equal to 100, right? So this number, divide the number first, divide the number by 4. So 128 by 4 is equal to 4 3 is 12. 4 to the 8. Put to 0 after that. So this is the answer. Yes. Next, let us take some other number. 256 into 25. Again, divide the number by 4. This number you divide by 4. 256 divided by 4. 4. 6 is 24, 4 4 is 16, then 0, 0. Yes. Then, after that, any number will take some other number, big number. 1, 20, or we'll take, suppose, 226 into 25. Divide this number by 4. Now, you just see here, 226 Divided by 4, what will get? 4, 5, 20, then 26, 4, 6, 24. So, remainder is 2. Now, answer will be what? This quotient, 56. Then, after that, multiply the remainder by 25. 25 to the 50. So, answer is 5650. Isn't it interesting? Let us take some more bigger number. 1, 2, 3, 6. 
into 25. So we have to divide this number by what? 4. So 4 trees are 12, then 4 nines are 36, then put two zeros. That means wherever the remainder is 0, then you put two zeros at last. And if the remainder is not 0, that number you just multiply by 25. So maximum you'll be getting either 1, 2 or 3. So 1 into 25, you know 25. Then 2 into 25, you know 50. Then 3 into 25, you know 75. So accordingly, you do. Let us take one. So accordingly, you do. Let us take one more number. Yes. 2060 into 25. Okay. So 2060, you divide by 4. 4 fives are 20, then 4 ones are 4, then 20, 4 fives are 20. So answer is 51500. Zero, zero. Isn't it interesting? Then next, one amazing fact of maths I'm going to tell you. Suppose, you just, all of you know that 12 square is equal to 1. 44. All of you know. Now write the number in reverse order. What will get? 21 square. And 21 is equal to what? Write this in reverse order. 441. You can check yourself. 12 into 12 is 144. And if we write this number in reverse order, we get 21. And 21 square is equal to 441. Okay? One more number. 13 square is equal to all of you know 169. Do you know that 31 square is equal to 961? Very interesting. Write this number in reverse order. It will be 31. And this number also you have to write in reverse order. That is 961. Very interesting. You please find out some other numbers. If any other number has got this type of things and write in the comment section. Okay? So I think all of you have enjoyed the video. You have come to know how much interesting facts are there. So different tricks you have come to know so that you can do the calculations very fast and you can save your time in exam. So if you like the video, please like, share and subscribe. And also you tell me which trick you like the most in the comment section and all of you know that uh, sharing is caring so please share with your friends so that your friends are also benefited by this video till then bye bye take care and keep smiling